Donkey uh, 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 You know, I really like this weekend. One of the best, actually. I don't like it because it's very cold, guys. It's minus 30 Celsius. Yeah, I don't like it either. I even got hit in the face with snow. It doesn't feel very good. <laughs> I love playing snowball fights. Let's go. Whoever gets hit loses. Let's <laughs> watch it. Wow. Well, you lost. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Either, but it's some kind of like massive thing. Well, it looks like a slide. Why is it here in our studio? Which one of you ordered this huge slide to our studio over here? Oh, listen, it's quite possible that it was me, but it definitely wasn't me. So you ordered it without our. No, 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 no. I didn't order that anything. delivery service brings this kind of slide. <gasps> Guys, whoever did this. should dismantle it and throw it away? Uh, maybe we don't throw it away as is. Maybe we shouldn't ride at full speed off the bat. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, Alina, Alina, do you really want to slide down? Who wouldn't want to slide down from up here? I wouldn't. Come on, you guys. Listen, are you really serious about this? Bruno, I love riding slides here. You know what? Maybe you can wait for summer and then enjoy the regular slides. You know, the kind you find on the playground. Yeah, I totally agree. Bruno, by the way, there's no possibility to do that outside. Our butts will freeze. But if I ride the slide right now, my butt will be just fine and I won't have to wait for summer. Well, I wouldn't trust this slide that just appeared in our studio out of nowhere. But if you really want to, then Pasha and I will be waiting you down here. Okay, guys, we're going to have a great time on the slide now. And we'll do some challenge later. Guys, I'm sliding down. One, two, three. Yeah. Alina! 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 Hey! <sighs> Alina! Are you there? Where? Listen, I cannot see the end of this slide. Yeah, me too. I can't see Alina either. You know what, Pasha? I don't know how to explain this, but this slide is much longer from the inside than it looks from the outside. Sliding down from up there takes literally about three seconds. Well, it seems like it. Maybe she got stuck in there? Yeah, well, maybe. Maybe it's just a longer inside, and she's about to slide down. Let's wait for a couple hours, and maybe we'll see her. She'll come out or something. Listen, there is no time to wait. Alina might be stuck inside the slide. Maybe everything is fine. Come up after me. I think that it's a bad idea right now. You know, I cannot see the end at all. It's like one kilometer long. That can't be. Someone made it and built it. At some point, they probably got tired and they didn't finish it. Maybe some IT guys created it. That's why it's not working properly. Listen, anyway, we need to go down after Alina. No, that's a bad idea, Bruno. Even if she's stuck, do you want to get stuck in there too? Then I get stuck and then all three of us will get stuck. We need to come up with a different plan. But we don't have much of a choice here we have to go after her listen we should first check it out we'll throw something in there and then see what happens whether it gets stuck or rolls out of this thing and what do you think we should throw in there a flashlight maybe uh, we still need the flashlight oh here's we can throw this thing here Actually, this is a valuable item. Put it back under the video. No, well, wait. It's it's our choice. What are we supposed to do? Throw our clothes in there or something? All right, but I'll be catching that priceless subscribe button from the other side, and I hope it makes it down. I hope so, too. Let's check. Maybe it'll go down with Alina. Let's go, Pasha. I'm ready. Throw the button. All right, then. I'm going to throw it. You ready? Catch it. Yeah, I'm catching the subscribe button. And... Pasha, what did you do? What? It did roll out correctly, right? So everything is just fine. Well, it did roll out, but it's not the same as it was before. We had the subscribe button, and now we have subscribe button. This means we lost one subscriber. Oh, that doesn't seem good. Take it, throw it back, and I'll be at the bottom to catch the subscribe button. Let's return everything to how it was. Well, logically, if uh, the subscribe button changed this, then it should reverse itself back somehow, right? And... 
How is it? Save us before. And what do we do now? We don't have any subscribers on the channel now. No one is subscribed to our channel anymore. What do we do about this, Basha? Dude, this is so weird, man. All right, well, Basha, I have one option left, and I hope it works. Guys, our only hope is you, the viewer who's watching this video right now. Maybe you can help me and Pasha. We need to change this button back to subscribed. It's very important for our channel. Let me put this button under the video now. And oh, now you can find it right under the video. Look, now under the video you're watching, there's a button that says subscribe. Click on it and it will change to subscribed. And how about you try and set the new world record for subscribing speed? The record is five seconds. Can you subscribe to the channel in three seconds? Come on. If you can, then you're an absolute legend. One, two, three, meow. Well, did it work? Basha, our viewers are the best. They've won. We've set a new record for subscribing speed. Listen, I'm putting the subscribe button back and don't take it out from there anymore, okay? Okay, fine. Uh, well, now what? Now we're going down the slide together and try to rescue Alina because for some reason she's stuck in there. And if the button was able to slide down but Alina wasn't, this means that she's in trouble. Well, I don't have any more arguments, but I still don't want to go down there. I have one assumption. Most likely, this isn't just a regular playground slide. Uh, there's information online that there are carnivorous slides, and this might be one of them. This is SCP-1562 carnivorous slide. But the thing is, people disappear there only under one condition. If they slide down head first and keep their arms by their sides. Alina went down like that, right? Uh, yeah, I don't remember. Guys, do you remember how she did it? If she went head first with her arms by her sides, then she definitely got stuck because of that. Well, maybe that's how it was. Yeah, maybe she did slide down like that. Uh, listen, I'm, I'm sweating because I'm too worried about Alina. I'll slide down first, but you follow me right away. Okay. Guys, and make sure everything is done properly. And never ever slide down the way we're doing it right now. Seriously, guys, you shouldn't do this. Please don't. <sighs> Sliding down in a jacket is not an option. Dude, you think it's an option without the jacket? And what if it's unexpectedly cold down there or something? Who knows? Oh, it's definitely freezing out there. Can you feel the trap? That's what I'm talking about. All right, we'll do without the jacket and I'll just send it. Okay, I'm sliding down. All right, let's go, let's go. This is a bad idea, man. Ah! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Send our jackets! Here comes the first one. Second one's on its way. And also this. All right, let's do this. Oh, no. Hey, Bruno, you got it, right? Bruno? What are we getting into again? All right, let's go. now, so, uh, uh, Alina! Alina! Listen, she must be somewhere around here, or I don't know. Yeah, she's definitely not here. You know, this slide looks way, way bigger from the inside. Yeah, that's true, but uh, it's not helping us at all. This looks like a cave or something, and it's leading somewhere deeper. Maybe Alina, well, since she's not here. She may be out there. Probably, yeah, most likely. And it makes sense. Look over there. Operator, shift this one here. Don't be shy. So the path goes that way too. So where do we go from here? Left or right? We can split up, of course, but I really don't want to. I mean, I split up with you just now and I didn't like it very much. So staying together is a much better idea, you know? Then let's go that way. <sighs> All right, let's go. Listen, there is a problem. Apart from the fact that it's very cold in this cave, there's also very cold and icy water right under our feet. Are we really going to stand on it? Maybe we should just move somewhere else. Well, sounds like a plan. Guys, hide and seek week has 
has not started yet. Where are you hiding? <laughs> no one's here. All right, no big deal. I'll find you. Bruno? Pasha, where are you? Bruno? They're not here either. Where are they then? I can't find them at all. Where did they hide? <gasps> they probably decided to slide down the slide too. Come out now. What are you doing there, huh? Ooh, what is that? Willie Bruno's cap? Wait, what if they rode the slide and haven't returned yet? What kind of slide is this? <gasps> SCP. This is SCP slide. And apparently they went head first with their hands by their slides and therefore they disappeared. I've heard about this SCP slide, guys. If you also know what this is, then please write yes, we know in the comments. So, oh, they ended up in another world, a parallel universe. And this William Bruno's cap brings him luck, actually. He can't go anywhere without it. I need to send it down. Okay, but, um, where's the front of the cap? I guess that's it. Okay, I hope it actually works. Oh, oh he catches it. We need to figure out what, how to save them urgently. Do you hear that? Huh? Something, something's coming. Yeah, something. Uh, oh, oh, that's my cap. Where did it come from? That thing just fell from the sky. Uh, probably it just came from above, or I don't know. All right, listen, let's go check what's there. Maybe uh, Alina's there. Alina! Alina! Damn, all of this water! Alina, are you there? Yeah, for sure. Where else could she be? Alina, we've got for you! Alina! Uh, damn, there's water all over the place. Yeah, my feet are already wet, despite wearing these shoes. Guys, just look at this water. It's so cold that it immediately turns into ice right here. Hey, Pasha, there is some kind of passage here. Let's go this way. All right, I'm coming. Hold on. Huh? Check it out. Oh. This is a picture of the very SCP slide. Well, the one we're in right now, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What does it mean, though? That we're not in a regular slide after all. Well, it's already clear that we're not in a regular slide. Well, I had doubts, but now it makes sense. So, yeah, the problem is clear, though, right? Yeah, the problem is clear. Yeah. Uh, we have understanding the problem is half of the solution. Bruno, we have to find Alina, right? And then we gotta get the heck out of here. Let's go there. Alina! Alina! Bruno, where did you run away to? Look, I found something. There are huge tracks here. Some kind of creature. Well, one track, then another. Another one, and most importantly, look at that enormous poop! Why are you touching with your hands if it's poop? Nah, it's just a rock. Hey, let's follow this track but carefully because whoever left these tracks... Well, it's pretty big, yeah? Yeah, three times bigger than us. Maybe he knows where Alina is. Bush, the tracks lead here somewhere. What about Alina's tracks? Shh, do you hear that roar? Oh, that's not Alina. Bush, look. I think this is someone's blue hair. Yeah, it reminds me of something. Oh, Basha, Basha, there's some, something enormous and blue over there. It's some huge, very blue monster. How about we follow it? Maybe we shouldn't. Maybe we should just walk away from it. Look, it's heading somewhere. I'm going after it. No, don't do it, Bruno. He's always getting into these adventures, and I'm just sick and tired of it. Pasha, what's wrong with you? Dave. He's about to leave soon. It's scary. Maybe it's even better if he leaves. Ooh, how tired I'm of this cave. Ooh, what's this? Human tracks. I need to find them. Pasha, it turns out that's Huggy Wuggy. Yeah, I can see that now. What should we do? I don't know. It's unlikely he can tell us where Alina is. You no, know, we can try, but I doubt we'll get a right answer. How about we just quietly leave from here before he notices us? Finally, our... finally a good decision for me. Come on, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Ah! Hey, ah! wait! Pasha, what are you doing? Ooh, humans! Let's get let's out go, of here! Let's go, let's go, let's go! He's after us! Let's hide! Let's hide here! Okay. I believe he went the other way. High five. Okay. No, don't high five me. Actually, he chased us because of you. Oh, yeah, we're here today because of you. 
How could you fall down in a flat spot? Hey, dude, on purpose, I lost my balance for a moment. Okay, the main thing is that we're not being chased by Huggy Wuggy. Yeah, you know what would be good? It would be good to have a quick bite. I'm really hungry, to be honest with you. Yeah, I'd love to get something to eat too, but we're in a cave right now, inside a carnivorous slide. I don't think we can find a restaurant here. Uh, well, there's a restaurant right there. Look at that. Uh... Look, let's say there's a restaurant banner here. Well, it's here for a reason. Maybe the slide just ate the restaurant banner? Well, if it ate the restaurant banner, then maybe it ate something from the restaurant as well. Well, good point. Okay, let's go check it out. Huggy Wuggy should be there. Basha, it seems like alongside the restaurant banner, the slide ate a half of the restaurant itself. Yeah, but everything here doesn't look as appetizing as I planned. Apparently, it ate this table a long time ago. Oh. Look, there's a new vegetable resembling cauliflower, I think, has grown on this tomato. Man, even dog food is better than this. And this used to be a cherry pie. And look at the bananas here. Well, with bananas, the darker <laughs> they are, the tastier. There you go, uh, then. Enjoy it, man. <laughs> this is probably too much. You know, it's too... Uh, it's, uh... Uh, of course, we don't have much of a choice, but I'm not that hungry to eat this, this cold pizza, man. You could knock somebody out with this thing right on the forehead, and they would be out cold. Look at what happened to these cucumbers. Same thing that happened to the other food, and you could use them like this. Ah! Humans, I found you. Uh, uh, Huggy Wuggy, you want a rotten apple? Then catch it. It fell. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> While he's eating that rotten apple. You need to knock him out right now. Hey, yeah, let's take this with us just in case. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We're leaving. Right here. Come on, come on, come on. Guys, I got an idea. I'll just tie myself to a rope. And I'm going after the guys. Okay, so let's do it like this. I think this is secure, and I hope they are actually waiting for me. Let's fix the rope over here. Double knot, so I won't stay there with the guys, actually. Time to set up, guys. I'm coming to you. Whoa, guys, it's so long. I can't see where it ends so deep, like, as long as the rope holds, I can descend, but not too far. I'm coming, guys. Hello, where are you? <laughs> guys, there's such a trap there. There's a portal to another place where it is incredibly cold. Right, what should I do? How can I save them? Maybe I need to throw some warm clothes in there so they don't freeze. <gasps> Do you hear that? Maybe it's the guys. I don't need to see them. <laughs> guys, I'm here. Move toward my boys. Can you hear me? I'm here. Uh, guys. <gasps> this is, this is Joe. I have what's wrong with me? Where am I? Jeff, where's Jeff? Guys, it's Jeff. Before he notices me, we need to hide. Uh, where did he come from out of the slide? He wasn't there. He didn't crawl into our slide. Which means he came from a parallel world. All right, what should I do? All right, think, 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 think. We need to take a look around. Guys, if Jeff came from the slide, then there are monsters over there. And where the guys are right now, there are a lot of monsters slugging them. They're having real adventures. Well, I'm stuck here alone with Jeff. Uh, what's this? Candice. Uh, Jeff loves Candice. Uh, no. uh, uh, what's this? Candice with likes? Jeff. Loves candies with likes. Uh, uh, these candies with likes are very rare and delicious. Jeff loves candies. Guys, Jeff is stealing our candies. He's not just eating any candies. He's eating my favorite ones, like that. Like these candies, they're really hard to get. It's they're like not a lot of them in the store. 
store. He's going to eat all of them now. And they're my favorite. Guys, let, like, help me out. Just like this video. And then Jeff won't be eating my favorite candies there. Because, like, the likes from the candies will disappear and appear under this video. And then I'll be happy and Jeff won't steal our favorite candies. So, hurry up and hit the like button or you'll eat everything. Click, click, click it, click it. And this candy's room likes are a feast. I'll eat one more. What? What? Huh? Only tasteless candies left. Where are the candies of likes? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. But I need to come up with a plan to get rid of him because he won't let me save the guys. I'll go think of a plan somewhere else. Uh, looks like I hid from Jeff. I have an idea, but for that idea, I need bait, and I can't be the bait, so I need to create it. Look what I have here, a toy car, but Jeff won't fall for it just like that, you know, so it needs a little modification. With the help of this gift paper, I'll show you everything. <laughs> the candy car is ready. He'll definitely fall for this kind of candy. My task is just to lure him out of that large room there. What? A big candy? And it's running away from me? Stop! Stop! Stop, candy! Stop! Delicious candy! Right, Jeff is not a problem for now, and I will take the candies, my candies, by the way, and do something there. He managed to eat just a little bit of them, but that is okay. Look at what I'm going to do, and I'll mark a path with candies from the entrance to the slide. Jeff will follow this path, gobbling up candies one by one, and We'll reach the very slide where I got him back to his world from where he came. After that, I will go rescue the guys. I'm running out of time. They might have frozen there. It's so windy. Okay, there we go. Um, okay, on the stairs and right there. And I'll hide behind this camouflage and be ready. Can you see me? <laughs> the candy. Run away from me. What? Candy? <laughs> He's taking the bait. I need to carefully watch him so he doesn't see me. Candy, candy, more candies. <laughs> Jeff's a true sweet tooth. Candy. <laughs> Yeah, let's go before Huggy Wuggy catches up with us. Oh, wait, does it seem like Jeff is right in front of us now? Oh, if it seems like it's both of us, might that be a coincidence? I really don't think so. Look, oh, 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 those are Alina's candies. Yeah, and we're actually in the same place where we initially landed. Isn't that right? Exactly. We started our journey inside this slide right here. Listen, I think I'm starting to understand what's happening here. Right here in this place, there's probably some kind of portal or something. And that's why we ended up here and these candies and Jeff fell here just like us. So it seems that Jeff was at the studio and like us, he climbed into the slide. If Alina's candies are here and Jeff is also here, right. then Jeff was at the studio. Yeah. And met Alina. Uh-huh. Meaning Alina is at the studio. Well, dang it, I told you, we just had to wait for her. She must have been inside of the slide for a long time, and then she climbed out and is still... Uh... Listen, that's not what we're discussing right now. We urgently need to get out of here, back to the studio, but how? Hey, listen, we fell from above, right? We fell over here from above. Yeah. So most likely, the portal is up there. All right, listen. Uh, 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 hey, Jeff. You know, he's probably going to lie here for a very long time. Okay, all right, somewhere around here, this should be the portal. And... Wow! And there it is! Excellent. Now let's get out of here. Oh. Basha, we found the portal. Listen, getting to it isn't that simple as it seems. 
So come on, try it. Okay. Come on, climb. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Dang, I can't do it. Uh, uh, all right. So listen, there's another option. Well, that doesn't work either. You know what? So we cannot reach the portal. Well, yeah. So let's just take these candies here. If we're stuck here for a while, they'll come in. Okay. Here. Good point. Jeff probably won't need them anymore. Listen, I, uh, I saw a ladder while we were here, like, running back and forth earlier. A ladder? You're telling me that the slide swallowed a ladder? Well, it seems so, you yeah. You know, quickly take me to the ladder uh, with grab a cap to look uh, yeah, more yeah. stylish, you know? I dropped it earlier. Right. Maybe over there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Where's the ladder, Pasha? Here it is, here it is. Indeed, here well, it is. Grab it from that side. Why didn't you tell me about it earlier? I didn't think it was necessary, and I was hungry. Yeah. We had other stuff to do as well. All right, let's quickly drag it away somewhere. It's <laughs> <heavy>. <laughs> now. Pasha, go. Take the ladder and run. Bruno, I will leave you. Puppy Wuggy. What should I do now? What should I do? Oh, I've got an idea. I have candies. I can bargain with them just like my dad taught me. All right. Hey, Puppy Wuggy. Ah. Look at this. Check out what I have. Ah. Huh? Let's see. See that? What's these candies? I haven't had a candies. These are really good candies. And what are you offering me? Candies? Candies, Huggy Wuggy. And they're different, too. Look at this one. It's for William Bruno. And if you let us take that ladder over there, there's twice as many candies, twice as many, and twice as tasty. That's it. There you go. Good boy. Here's the candies. Try them. They're super delicious, super tasty. Yeah, it's been a while since I had real food. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Take the ladder and let's head back to the portal. So, okay, put it right here. Listen, and where's Jeff? Oh, well, he probably got up by now. We gotta do everything faster. There's two of them, Huggy Wuggy and there's Jeff. All right, all right, I'm on it, I'm on it. The portal should be around here somewhere. I will try to open it somehow. Somewhere around here. Whoa! What's there? Okay, bear with me. Uh, I'm trying to find it. <laughs> Guys, we could barely get rid of Jeff. Bye-bye, Jeff. Ooh, uh, Bruno? Bruno, it's you. Uh, uh, whoa! Just look, someone grabbed my hand. Well, who is this? Is it Alina? I don't know, but I'm, I'm trying, I'm trying to... Uh, 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 uh. What if it's another monster? Well, who cares? As long as you drag me from here. here. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, don't drag me, drag me. Catch it. I almost got him out. Which means we can figure it out how to get them out of there. We need to come up with a plan urgently. Look, Basha. What? Thanks for the glove. You broke the ladder. You know, maybe it's not that bad after all. If it's ladders, I don't know how. Well, okay. Let me try to climb it. Just break it again. Hold on. I got it. <laughs> well, I guess that's it. Now we're stuck here forever. I have a theory that there is a portal in the middle of the SCP slide. We slide down here from here, enter the portal. This portal leads to some kind of world. I don't know which one because like I haven't been there, but Bruno and Pashka are there now for sure. And there are probably other monsters too. I for the life of mine don't know what kind of monsters, but they're definitely there because Jeff came from there. And I have a theory that the guys will be able to return and if they enter the portal again it'll bring them back to another part of the slide in short my theory is that there is a portal in the middle of the slide and i have questions why haven't the guys returned home from the portal yet like from over there like must be some blockers either they can't reach the portal or something is preventing them from it or someone so we need to establish contact with them i'll throw this walkie talkie down the slide and we will try to get in touch with them and then we might come up with a plan to free them so guys let's go we're sending them this walkie talkie all right I hope you'll catch it! <laughs> Oi. Oh, dude! Uh, it's a walkie-talkie!
walkie-talkie, Basha! Looks like Alina threw us a walkie-talkie to stay in touch! Yeah, that's great. Thanks, Lena. But you didn't have to throw it right at my head. Let's turn it on. Frequency mode. Guys, it's Alina! Can you hear me? Over! How are you doing? Things have definitely been better, Alina! I've certainly been better. In short, we ended up inside this SCP slide. It, it just swallowed us, and we really want to get out somehow. Very much. And, and, and we had a ladder, but someone has broken it. Yeah, we don't know who. They ended up in the SCP world just like I thought. My theory is working. <laughs> Where are they? Listen, Alina, we have a little problem here. A big problem, actually, a really big. Jeff with a stick, can you find some rope and throw it to us quickly? Come on, Alina. Uh, guys, guys, can you hear me? What happened? What happened? <laughs> <laughs> Jeff noticed us! Dude, we need to get out of here! Monkey Wonky's there too! Listen, get up! They've already noticed us anyway! Hello everyone! You are on the channel Cool Life Hacks, and today I'll tell you what to do if you are stuck inside a slide. This is what I need! The first thing to do is not to panic. The second thing to do is to try to get out and not to panic. Yeah, I get it! Tell me, how do I free them? <gasps> All right, we'll find out later. Elena, how are things with the rope? Guys, I can't hear you. I'm here. Just get the rope, please. Help, Elena. <gasps> Guys, I urgently need to find a rope. <laughs> but where can I find such a long rope? Guys, you can help me find a rope. Just write where the rope is and like in the comments. And so as soon as you write it, I'll see the comment and I will find that rope quickly. So write, come on. Oh, there's the first comment. Oh. <sighs> Seems like the rope is on the wall, but which wall? And oh, here's the second comment. The rope behind your hanging on the wall. All right. <gasps> you guys are great. Thank you, you're awesome! Uh, I don't need this now. Guys! Okay, I'm going on to this. Like, like this, guys, I'll save you. I just need a couple of minutes. Okay. Uh, okay, guys. Catch! Be careful, here it comes! They'll be back soon! Whoa! This is just what we need! Come on, Bruno! <sighs> okay, damn, how far should I crawl? Alina, hold the rope, don't let it go! Basha, come behind me! Yeah, 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 I, I think it's working! Got, got it! <sighs> Whoa. Basha, come on! It worked! Keep going just a little bit more! <sighs> Great, we're here! But there, there's a problem! Alina, cut the rope so Huggy Wuggy can come down after us! Hurry, Alina! I'm on it! Guys! I'm coming! Finally! Listen, Alina, we have a very important task. I thought that we were done for. We urgently need to plug this hole. What, what happened? Yeah, let's do it quickly. So that no one else from this light can get into our world. By the way, <sighs> you did it right because this is the exit to our world. And there's an entrance to parallel one. I'm starting to not understand anything. And hello there, friends. My name is William Bruno, and with me today is legendary Alina. And you know what's gonna happen today? We're gonna make a double call to two of SCP's most legendary monsters. Carton Cat and Carton Dog. And this is all for a reason. The last time we saw Carton Cat and Carton Dog in front of us, they disappeared before our eyes. We wonder if they're even alive and if they will come to us. And well, what are they going to do in general? We're really wondering how this this story of theirs ended. 
Are they still alive? And guys, let me tell you something. I have the number of Cartoon Cat in my phone and Alina was able to get the number of Cartoon Dog. And who are you going to call first? I think that since we've known Cartoon Cat for a long time, he'll pick up the phone for sure. If, if he's still alive. But it's still unclear about Cartoon Dog though. And that's why I'd like to start with calling Cartoon Dog because we don't know him at all all yet. Look, I think you should start by calling someone who's coming 100% and then we can tell Cartoon Dog like, <coughs> Cat's already here, you should come too. <coughs> I'm sorry, Alina. <laughs> What's happening to you? <coughs> Alina! <coughs> Alina! There's something, something wrong with my arm! <coughs> and my leg too! Guys, guys, I'm turning into a one big bad red subscribe button. Alina, what's wrong with you? I'm turning into red button too. Oh, guys, that's not good at all. We can turn into red buttons now. Our time hasn't come yet, guys. We've got to fix this somehow. And we cannot do it without you guys. If you have a red button just like this one down below the video. Or a button that looks something like this one on me. Look guys. So you have our fates in your hands right now. And you, yes, you can really save our lives. Just click on that red button below the video and we'll be healed in no time. I'm sure of it. Hit it. Come on. Hit that, hit that red button. Come on. Click on it. And bam. <gasps> Here we are, good as new. Thank you so much. I've become ordinary. I'm not a button anymore. Listen, Alina, we have to get down to serious business and call Cartoon Dog. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's think carefully first. We're summoning the two of the strongest creatures in the world. Listen, why don't you handle your personal problems and come up with some plans later? I'd like to jump straight into adventures, and that's why I'm already dialing. You know what? At the very least, I'm going to need this in the nearest future. I should admit, that's quite a useful tool you have. It's mine. Okay, if something happens, protect me, please. Okay, as always, you always get in some kind of trouble and I'm supposed to carry this baseball bat. Okay, guys, we're about to call Cartoon Dog now. I'm ready for the call. <gasps> so, are you ready? Of course, I'm always ready. That's it, I'm dialing, guys. We're calling Cartoon Dog, as you can see. Let's try to switch to FaceTime if, like... Whoa, listen to that tune he has. He loves music, apparently. Okay, come on, pick up the phone. Come on! Uh, hello? Hello? Is he asleep? Nah, he's growling for some reason. Look, this is really Cartoon Dog. Uh, we were wondering if you wanted to take part in our video. Is he barking or what? Let's ask him how he's doing. Cartoon Dog, uh, how, uh, how are you doing? How are you? <laughs> Look, he, he turned on the video! Wait, I'll be coming to your studio soon. And I will deal with you. <gasps> he hanged! What, what did we do uh, to him? I, I don't know. Why did he even start barking? He just started barking during the call like, like a real dog. Seriously. It was just a friendly call. Why so angry? And he said he was coming over for us. It's good that you brought a bat. Of course it's good. A super being is coming. I wouldn't mind having a bat. Let's hide and call your cat. Guys, this is serious. Things are becoming a bit messy right now. And Cartoon Dog is going to be at our studio any minute. So we need to hide well with Alina and call Cartoon Cat. Bruno, where are you? Why did you run away? I'm hiding. What do you mean? You're hiding. Come here. This is a decent place. Let's call the cat already. Uh, okay. Uh, are you sure this is the best place to hide? Way better than yours. I could see your butt from there. Your butt is always visible. Get it? Are you ready to call your friend yet? Okay. Now, guys, we're gonna call Cartoon Cat so he may help us to deal with this dog. Okay, okay, I'm calling Cartoon Cat now. I hope he's okay and he picks up the phone, so gotta calm down. Come on, come on, man, answer the call. Ah, you guys, all right. Hello, the William Bruno. Hey, Cartoon Cat, it's, it's us. Listen, anyway, we called Cartoon Dog and he said he's coming to our studio, so what should we do? Uh, was he angry? You not angry, you think? Uh, he was very angry, Cartoon Cat. He was very angry. Okay, I hear you. Wait for me at the studio. Keep your heads down and I'll come and try to solve this Cartoon Dog issue. 
miss you. Uh, I'll be there soon. Uh, all right, bye. Bye. Thank <laughs> you very much, Carton Cat. Disconnected. Man, he's such a good friend. Although sometimes he does horrible things, but all in all, he's a good kitty. I think he's changed since he's been in your body. It's good that Cartoon Cat is coming. I feel kind of safe. Do you think Cartoon Cat will really help us? <laughs> It looks like Cartoon Dog is already in our studio! Listen, why is he so fast? I don't know, well, apparently dogs run fast. Listen, here you go, go check it out. Well, where's there to check? I'm sure he's, he's, he's at our studio already. You're our leader, you're tall and well, I think you should check it out. Bruno, please, come on, come on, come on. Damn, so that's the kind of protector you really are. You got a bat for me to wield it, didn't you? you thank me for bringing the bat at all. That's it, Cartoon Dog! I hope we don't make... Maybe we, uh, shouldn't have called him after all? Yeah, it's the perfect time for you to come to your senses, man. Well, he's already at our doorstep. What if he's right outside the door, Alita? I hope not. Yeah! Uh, <sighs> don't come out that far. Well, I must check if Cartoon Dog is there or not. Come on, stay behind me, Alina. Now we need to check every corner so we can clearly see where our enemy is. <sighs> can you see anyone? I don't think so. Just you. Alina, let's look around everywhere. I'm gonna check this box now. Go ahead, check it. What's wrong? We've got a mouse in there. It's it's all right. It's fine now. Are you now. stupid or what? What mouse? What's wrong with you? You're doing it on purpose. You're scaring me. Stop it, Bruno. I'm telling you the truth. I fought bravery for our. <laughs> it's growling outside the building again. Uh, Okay, guys, you know what I realized just now? This bat is definitely not enough for us. We need some real large-scale power here, and I think you know how to get it. Only if all of us get together and click on the like button under the video, then the power of the likes will transfer to this bat right here, and then it will be hitting a hundred times harder than usual. I've heard this legend. When people collected 100,000 likes and channeled all those likes into a weapon, the weapon became special. Come on, boys and girls, I believe in you. Come on. Holy moly, guys, we did it. We've got a like bat right now. And with this weapon, guys, we can definitely stand up to Cartoon Dog. You know what I'm saying? Look, let's go check other rooms. How about that? Whoa, wait, 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 wait. I hear barking coming from the big room we were in just now. Let's go check it out. Do you hear anything? Nothing so far. Listen to me, let's have a good look around and then we'll think about what to do next. Yeah, I wish Cartoon Cat would come soon because this this light bat is a powerful weapon, of course, but we might actually use some help here anyway. He was right there. Look, I don't see anything at all. It's really empty. Look, we need to check other rooms so we may learn exactly where he is before he finds us first. Come on, we gotta go. You know what? You're right. We should look for Cartoon Dog in other other rooms, but I'll stay here because he's definitely not here and I'll hold the ground here, but I need a bet. No, well, I mean whether you stay or not, but I need the bet more. Come on. Come on, give me the bet because you already walked around with it and now it's my turn. Let's take turns. Come on. <clears throat> Whatever, stay here with that bet. The subscribers will come with me then. I'm sure you'll be able to get back to me quickly if anything happens. As soon as you see him, run over here. Let's go. Go, go, go. Okay, okay. all right. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Guys, follow me. Okay, Alina, if you need anything, just shout. I'll be right there to help. We need to quickly find out where Cartoon Dog is to better understand which side the danger is coming from. I don't like to be alone, to be honest with you. Despite the fact that Alina is a girl, I feel much safer when she's around. So, okay, I'll check the warehouse now. Okay, I've pretty much looked all over the studio and... I'm not sure how I'll be able to gain some muscles before we meet Cartoon Dog, you know, but but I'm doing this just in case. So look, we've got here a punching, like, uh, dummy. 
guys, I've checked everything here pretty much. I don't know. I've looked around the warehouse, looked around the shower rooms, I've looked around our dressing room. There is nobody anywhere. I don't know, maybe what we heard was not barking after all. Like, okay, I'll check one more room and then I'll get back to Alina. Mm. You guys, I looked at the channel statistics this morning and discovered that boys hit like buttons more often than girls. Only 30% of girls. This is not good. So now I'm gonna turn to girls. If you can hear me, please click on that like button. Come on, let's beat the boys on this one. Okay, guys. Cartoon dog is not here either. So, which is good. Okay. Did you hear that? It's coming from the room where Alina is. I don't know what's behind the door right now, but I hope William Bruno comes soon. What if that's Carrot and Dog? Okay, I can't take any chances, so I'm waiting for William Bruno. Bruno, where are you? Ah! Uh, uh, Alina, I heard some knocking and, and your cry for help. You're not the only one who heard it. Look, someone's breaking in. You could be. What if Cartoon Cat is already here? Come on, open it, open it, open it, open it. Oh, look, I'm scared a bit. Okay, for the sake of a good video, I'm about to open it. But if anything happens, be ready to strike. Just like that. Okay, yeah. I'm opening it. Uh, ah, you guys are not locking the doors. All right, hello there, William Bruno. Uh, hello, Cartoon Cat, and we, uh, we've been waiting for you. Where's Cartoon Dog? I'm gonna kick his ass real bad. Look, we didn't know either, to be honest with you. I even thought that, and, and Alina thought too, that it was Cartoon Dog breaking in. We didn't see him at all, but we heard him. He must be around here somewhere. Well, maybe you know where he is? Uh, okay, yeah, let's check it out. Ah, I can feel that Cartoon Dog is around here somewhere. He's very close, very, very close. Cartoon Cat, look, I think you're wrong. We've looked all over the place and he's nowhere to be found, literally. It's like he's messing with us. So, uh, uh, Cartoon Cat, oh, he's hissing like hell. Cartoon Cat, what's wrong with you? Are you sure he's an ally? It's like you really sniffed something. Look, we've been all over the place. There's nothing here. I'm telling you the truth. You just keep sniffing and sniffing, guys. What's he sniffing? Whoa! <laughs> Where did that cartoon dog come from? He wasn't even here. What? Look, cartoon dog dropped cartoon cat. Cartoon cat, come on, stand up. Come on, cartoon cat. Cartoon cat. <sighs> you, you, it's right, cartoon dog. I'll gather my strength and I'll kick your ass. You can't make it. Give up. No, because you can't never give us up. Ah! You may still have a chance to say a lot. Look, Alina, I think our Toon Cat is about to lose in a moment. I hope you'll gather his strength and beat him. Come on. Okay, I don't think we should hesitate any longer. We must, we must help our friend. <sighs> Cartoon Dog, get off him! Ah! What a punch! Ah! Oh, I didn't expect Cartoon Dog to be that strong. I flew about two meters away. Bruno, how are you? Look, I've been better, actually. Don't just stand there, Alina. You've got a bet with the power of our subscribers' likes. Help Cartoon Cat! You're right. This bet contains the power of all our subscribers. Did they give their likes in vain? We have to demonstrate this power to Cartoon Dog. The subscribers cannot be matched. Cartoon Cat! Cartoon Cat! Hey! Wake up! Wake up, Cartoon Cat! 
We've been through so much together. I cannot believe it. What's happening to you, Cartoon Cat? <gasps> Has he turned into sand? I hope to see you again one day, my friend. Elena! 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 Are you alive? Elena, wake up! Don't turn into sand on me, please! All right, all right. <laughs> Always works. I'm so glad that you're alive. What did you do? Here's a tissue. Alina, look. All that's left of Cartoon Cat is black sand. Is it really Cartoon Cat? It was Cartoon Cat once. And Cartoon Dog is gone for good. You were able to destroy him with the help of a pad that our subscribers emboldened with likes. Thank you so much for your support. I'm so glad that you're alive. No